Hey, what's happening, spider friends? Welcome back to Spider-Man, friend or foe, oh. episode six, amigos. Yeah. And uh, Amber's actually going to kick things off with Black Cat as we go back to the weird oh, jungle place. Yeah. And she has a comment of the day for you all, so. Yeah, so let us know in the comments below if you think Spider-Man is a friend or a foe, or is he just a menace to society? You've been watching too much, JJ. <laughs> Anyway, guys, we He's also see this video get uh, 500 <laughs> likes, and it's time for us to continue the Frenemies game with Black Cat. Because we made Black yeah. Cat much stronger now, so. Well, I thought that's what the title was about. Like, is Spider-Man a friend or a I didn't even know that um, his friends would be in this game. I thought it would just be like, are they friend or foe? Oh, maybe it's about his friends. Uh, and I read the title wrong. Well, I mean, he... I was always under the impression that this game you could just play as the enemies. Oh. oh, I make life so much easier by just tossing them out of bounds. Yeah, I forgot Black Cat has this thing. Boom! I totally forgot about that. What? Totally. The grappling thing? Yep. Whee! Oh, this is such a great stress reliever. It's like... Oh my gosh, I can go. just sit here in the air grabbing people. Okay, that's pretty sick. <laughs> Good stop! <laughs> <laughs> You're just gonna go endlessly? Looks like that's everybody. Sorry. Thank goodness. Uh, I'm not a fan I... of her voice in this, though. Thank goodness. Yeah, it's not very black catty. It needs to be more sultry. Thank goodness. Or something. I don't know. I don't know how she talks. Like Marilyn Monroe, kind of. Yeah. There was actually a really good voice actress who did Black Cat in the 90s Spider-Man. Like, yeah. That's pretty cool. Mm. Oh, uh, this isn't death here. Oh, good. Oh, that's, that's good. Thanks for testing that out for me, Spider-Man. Welcome. I'm a true gentleman. For skiing life or limb to test Black Cat. Yeah, I thought Black Cat is always supposed to be flirting with Spider-Man the whole time, even when he's dating Mary Jane. Yep. Because she's a bad person. Bad girl, yep. You're really just going to carry that, uh... Okay. I got it. All I don't, right. need, All I don't right. need any guy to help me out. Well, I mean, some versions of uh, Black Cat has the uh, Captain America super soldier serum, so... She doesn't totally. really need assistance. That's why I'm going way slower than you, because I'm a super soldier. But she has gotten hurt pretty bad in the 80s, I believe. She almost died. And Spider-Man was so distraught because he wasn't with MJ at that point. Toast. Oh, I see. He only cares about Black Cat when he doesn't feel like being with Mary Jane. <laughs> he and Mary Jane were on a break! So it's called Rebound! Oh, they are ugly. Hey! <laughs> oh my gosh, she sounds like... Oh, she sounds like the girl from uh, Kim Possible's uh, rival. But she go? Yeah. No. A little bit. Really? I thought she did. They need to make more beat-em-ups. There's not enough beat-em-ups this year. I liked it when we played that Kim Possible game. That was fun. That was a fun game. That was a hard game, though. We've played so many weird, obscure games. I love that about us. Makes like, us fun. Most, most people don't even know that, and they're like, I wish I could see you guys play this game. It's like, we already did. Play Fortnite. Play, uh, what, what's that other game? Uh, Roblox. Yep, Roblox. <laughs> Disney Infinity. Dig out Disney Infinity. All our figures are put away, and all our LEGO Dimensions figures are gone, too. We, we need the room. Well, we like looking at eclectic games, like, uh, fun things that remind us of our childhood and stuff. Like... This game just reminds me that there was a lot of decent games in 2007 I never looked at. <laughs> Whoops. This is really fun. Woohoo! I know, right? Off we go on another... Oh, this guy. Bye! So she kind of talks like, oops. Yeah, all of them. You say that after you fall to your death. Cool. I'm guessing Black Cat talks like Catwoman a little bit. Kind of. Like, that was a perfect no, 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 no. Well, I mean, one version did uh, Spectacular Spider-Man. She sounded like a cat burglar. Let's do this. Let's do this. Throwing... Ow! All right, these guys have trouble with a capital T. Get off my island! Oh. 
What? That didn't work. Goodbyes! How did you survive that? That's, that's not right. Okay, let's not do that. I'm tripping him. This guy's tripping. It's brawl. It's like tripping. Bye bye. Wait. You just seem to teleport in like crazy. Hey, 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 hey! Let's leave the spider alone, please. Do I push you and cause you pain? Maybe I do. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ah! Well, you go, girl. Whoa! Sunny. Pew, 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 pew. Yeah, how do you like we that? Again. I know, we make a great team. There, she sounds a little bit more like Black Cat there. What does Black Cat sound like, though? I have no idea. Yeah, I still say Marilyn Monroe. Ish. That's how I remember her sounding. Like, high society, but also, like, cool to have a secret identity as a superhero. She's like a, a socialite that is a cat burglar, like, you know, kind of like what they did with Catwoman in the animated series. Like Poison Ivy animated series. Yes, kind of, but yeah, a little different. More on the lines of that, though, yeah. Uh, is that a bridge? Huh, it is a bridge. Whoops! She's a femme fatale. Yeah, that's the term. All right, you guys need to, like, not throw bolas at people. It's not nice. So long, losers. Oh, that was satisfying. Ooh, you look like you're having a difficult time. Mm, I'm fine. I can take care of myself. Probably good. Oh, I don't know. Ow! I was trying to be Ray from Star Wars. Wait, Ray said that? Yeah, in the in the not in the movie, but how it should have ended? No, she said it in the in the game. Oh. Uh, <laughs> we was running around with her. That's what she said over and over again. I can take care of myself. Over and over and over again. In reality, if she really could take care of herself, then she would have actually helped other people when they had it. You know what? Never mind. I'm not gonna say. They actually uh, released the next how it should have ended finally, and um, I saw the ending of. Uh, how Star Wars should have ended. Oh my god. And it was like exactly what I wanted so to happen. Long, Phantoms. We showed them, didn't we? I'm glad they did a good one then. Oh they did. They you basically know. they took a um a page out of the uh, old Star Wars um, comic books where Luke Skywalker oh, is totally awesome. Yeah. Like instead of using, you know, how he defeated or Thank you. how he appeared, he did it old school like um, Star Wars comic book Luke Skywalker, like supreme awesome Jedi overpowered. And I believe uh, somebody even said, "Wow, Jedi's are OP before they die," <laughs> because yeah, Luke could do everything: freeze time, use his lightsaber to take down like adits, and it was just like, "Oh, that's, that's what it should have happened." That's what I was just thinking, like how it should have ended. Just read one of the actual books. Yep. There you go. That's how it should have been. Yeah, because apparently just... no Jedi, and other than um, Ben Skywalker, has been able to do that. If I was Mark Hamill and being Luke Skywalker, after I had to film those scenes at the end, I would have been bashing my head up against a wall like, why? Well, why? he took to social media and interviews and was saying how he didn't agree with the writer's direction. But that, then of that's course, his way of throwing a tantrum. But then, of course, later he said, oh, you know, I didn't understand the, you know, I'm glad that they went a new route and stuff. He backtracked. After that, yeah, well, like you have to backtrack. Disney doesn't allow so their, their stars to have drama. Yeah, it's in the contract. Whoa! Just like Sony doesn't allow their Spider Men not to show up for press events or their fired men. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I still can't believe the guy who fired Spider Man is. Do you remember that um, PlayStation executive? Like back in the day, the guy who said Ridge Racer. Like, uh, everybody used to make fun of him 10... From Japan? Yeah, 10, 12 years ago. He's yeah. the, He's been the big honcho at Sony since uh, a little bit before the Amazing Spider-Man movies. He was the guy who fired... Ridge Racer guy was the guy who fired Spider-Man for not showing up to a uh, press would, event. Why would he not show up, or at least to give a reason why he wasn't there, though? Um, He was tired from all the traveling he had to do in promoting the movie. But he didn't, you know, it was kind of a big deal that Spider-Man didn't show up for the Japanese premiere or something. 
Oh, wow. Yeah. Now that was impressive. Why doesn't he have a person that would handle that kind of stuff for him? Like an agent. Wouldn't his agent, like, call and say, like, hey, my guy's really tired. Is, you know, this okay? Or... Like, if he was really sick, I could understand. No, he wasn't sick. He was just being lazy. Uh -oh. Andrew Garfield is kind of lazy. Yeah, a smidgen well, lazy. Mostly. That's do, what do, I do, hear. Do, do, do. We're gonna throw boxes at your face with the controller. Yay! Oh. oh. Tiki okay. men! With technology. That's right. It's kind of like when you go to yeah. those conventions and you meet those YouTubers there and they're like, Oh, aren't you supposed to go to this and this thing, you know, for press? And then they're like, I don't know if I'm going to show up to that or not. And you're just like, okay. okay. See you <laughs> later. Just like, didn't this company help you come out here? I'm just confused. <laughs> like, just like, yeah. <laughs> Why are they glowing blue now? I don't know. Ah, it doesn't matter. Well, especially, like, if the guy... Like, if Sony had paid for him to come out there on the plane or yeah, something. Of course. Probably then I would be... And all that other stuff. Yeah, then you would definitely be upset, because it's like, uh... It's kind of funny that both of the previous Spider-Man actors, people always have something they can make fun of, but the current Spider-Man, it's really difficult to find things to make fun of him, because he's just a kid. Yeah. You know? Later, I'm sure he'll do something that'll become meme-worthy, but... For McGuire, you have Toby McCryer, and for Andrew Garfield, you have basically Millennial. Like, he just doesn't care about anything. It's Spider-Man. It's just weird that cool. him and Emma Stone, like, were together. I don't even think they're together anymore. It just feels like people just get together when, they're, when their characters are together on set. Well, it also shows that they're not the best actors and actresses. If their on-screen chemistry was actually... Because they were together. Yeah, it's like the only way that they can have on screen chemistry is to like just date each other. But uh, the same can be said for Michael Keaton and Michelle Pfeiffer. They did the same thing for Batman Returns. They were a couple during that movie. Yeah. And it's production. And then because they were on that movie together, they eventually broke up. So, I mean, some people yeah. just can't handle working together. They need their personal space. Yeah, that would be like, well, I like personal space sometimes. What's personal space? I don't know. I'm like a puppy. I follow Amper all over the place. <laughs> you do not. I sit on the same side of the booth with her. That's we me win. sitting. You lose. The end. Yay. Well, no, when you actually are working, though, I like to, it's hard for me to get to sleep. Unless I'm downstairs. I try to sleep on the couch next to you. But then I get a neck cramp because the couch has this, like, nub on it that hurts my neck. I don't think people know what a nub is. Let's it's roll. Like, it's like a, an arm of the couch. Mine! No, I wanted sorry. to throw that! I'm uh, sorry. I want this one. There are more. Yay. I'm happy now. Oh. Do we have to jump on that? Ha! <laughs> Oops! <laughs> I didn't realize I had to double jump. Oops. That was kind of funny. Woohoo! Oh. Um, maybe not follow me too closely. Come on, you gotta want it. You gotta want it. There you go. Sorry. Alley oop. Ooh. That looks fun. I think this explodes. Nope. Oh, now I get what that blue thing is. That's the Wii's version of freezing someone. <laughs> oh, <laughs> <That's> I so <see>. bad. <laughs> That's supposed to be ice. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I like being around you a lot, honey. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, what was the point of coming over here? Do you, Do you see a door or anything? I just see gems. I don't a... like being inside a lot, though. That's what I don't like. Yeah, I, I don't care. I like being inside. I don't think there's anything over here, so we should just leave. I don't even know how to leave, though. Gotta go back the way we came. Whee! What? I know, platforming. Ooh. Ooh, that's actually gonna be tough. Aha! Ah, I did it! Win! Oh, never mind. Go this way? Or up this bridge? Up this bridge it is! Whoa, whoa. 
Oh no, more of the same people we fought. Well, why do already? thugs get cutscenes? I just. Take long. Well, that's because we're powered up. Chill! I'm feeling. I'm feeling uh, like these thugs are gonna be more dramatic because the music is more dramatic. Nah. I feel like we have to be like almost at the brink of Ow. quitting or giving up right now because of the dramatic music. Spider Man, I can't hold them off much longer! How much more of these guys can we take? You're right, we should do a team up move! I don't know how to do that. I got it. This looks like it could be actually similar to a scene in a movie. Well, in the 90s or 2000s. I have no idea that web shooters would be that powerful. See, the pumpkin bombs make sense for that big of an explosion. The other stuff, not so much. Yeah, all the uh, team up moves are have the same. It's just the same, like, amount of impact, but they just, like, make it different. Well, since it's uh, Power Rangers' 25th anniversary, we have a Power Rangers game like this for a Power Rangers Samurai. Well, um, we could look at that for the Wii, like, next month. Or something like that. That would be cool. Or even this month, I don't know. This game, I have a feeling it's not going to take very long. And I'm having a blast, so... Playing something like this again would be awesome. Yeah, I like... I think Black Cat is a pretty good character because she has a long-range attack and short-range, where the other the other characters I've been all. playing with didn't have that. Keystone activated. Whee! I found a keystone. That's great. I know, it's actually pretty exciting. Hmm. I don't like the look of this old machinery. Me neither. It needs to be updated. We yeah, we got these guys. No bigs. Later, losers! Woohoo! Oh, you do have a grapple. I saw it. Kind of. I know. Whoa! Later! Look at the distance these guys get. Aww. I'm, gonna, I'm, gonna... <laughs> I'm just doing my move over and over again. Well done! Well done, you killed me! Thank you! <laughs> that was awesome! How did he. He was like floating in midair! That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> Boo! It's a weird game. Don't do that. Very talented. Acquired. Versus Arena. You mean we can fight one another? Oh no. Oh, that would be fun. Couples battle. Spider-Man versus Black Cat. Black Cat is a character I'm surprised didn't make it into Disney Infinity. Oh my gosh, mind jinx. I was thinking the same thing. I mean, because they essentially used the um, spectacular Spider-Man uh, thing as a model for that game, so Ooh. it makes sense. But they were yeah. going to do Spider-Gwen or something. Spider-Gwen? Spider-Gwen. I knew you were going to do that. Does whatever Spider-Gwen does. Yep. <laughs> Reads your books, gets straight A's. <sighs> what is that up ahead? It's a screw! <laughs> Falls down a long way and isn't okay. What? Oh, jeez. <laughs> I don't know. That was cool! <laughs> no, that was dark! <laughs> What is it? Don't encourage her, Spidey! <laughs> Don't you do it! Uh, oh! I fell down and went boom. Mina! Later, loser! Yeah, you don't get to fight him anymore. It's all, we... over. It's all over, yeah. It's all over for me, because. You've been benched! Oh, wait, that's. Wait, is there something over here? Cool! <laughs> I deserve that. Fail. I deserve oh, that so, so good. much. Oh, that's so good. Wee. Oh, oh they I gave thought, it to you. I thought I wasn't gonna make that. Pity. They gave you a pity thing. They're like, yeah, that's not gonna work. That's because I'm cute. Yeah, you can get away with that. Oh boy. Bum, bum, ba, dum, this won't take long. <laughs> Oops. Uppercut! And smashy smash. Ooh. No, I don't think so. Bye bye. Oops. Uh. Kind of survived that? Not really, though. Get off this platform. Ow. What was that called for? Alright. 
I don't know why you'd say all right. That's not what I was hoping for. <laughs> to... All right, all right, all right. <laughs> all right. All right. Get off this plane of reality. Goodbye. Ooh, so, there's something over go. here to jump on. Jump! Oh my gosh. Yeah, I know. You and jumping is... I nice. just have problems. I don't want... Boom. <sighs> Boom. Fine. I don't even know what the purpose of doing that. Can I pick this up just for the sake of picking it up? I have a big cylinder. I broke all these things because I'm... Whoa, don't give me a screen death, please. All right. Sorry. I'm going to throw a barrel at it. I have a, some kind of gear. I threw a barrel. It's awesome, Luke. I thought it was, actually. This has got to be around here somewhere. Ooh. Nice temple. So I'm going to step here. Yeah. Pretty shiny. The temple thing. Well done. We already know how this works, Fury. My gosh. Tell us what to do. You know, the aiming is difficult in this. I'm trying to aim toward this thing, but it just doesn't want to do its job. It's like, you know what? I'm going to think about it, and um, I'll get back to you. It's like, okay. It's fine. It's fine, game. Whatever you want to do. Pound puppies. Uh-oh. No spawning! Yeah! Massive damage. That's the name of the game. Yay! Later, loser! Nice Destruction! One. He went the distance. That's what heroes do. Destroy stuff? Or fall off cliffs? Because you've done that a lot. In my case, it's both. Yeah. Magic bridge. Ooh, this looks fun. Oh, that is one giant gear. Are you sure you can handle that? Whoa. Oh, I got this. Whoa, 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 whoa. Watch where you're putting that. Ah! All right. Get away from me. <laughs> Heads up. <laughs> hey there. Iron fist, right? Nice yellow booties. Spider-Man? <laughs> You got a problem with my boots? Well, I, uh... Just kidding. I owe you one. If you ever need help, just ask. Guess who you're playing as? Iron Fist! Uh, Iron Fist? Iron Fist. There's nothing funny about that name. Well, actually, there, there kind of is, but... Yeah. I'm gonna call him Yellow Booties. Booties Man. <laughs> a new character has joined Spider-Man. You can access this new sidekick from the Sidekick Select Terminal. Ooh. Like little baby booties. Yeah, they're, they're kind of small like that. It's going to say the sidekick thing. Don't forget to upgrade your sidekick. Oh, no, it's not. <laughs> well, anyway, guys and gals, that does it for this episode. Join us next time as Amber plays as Iron Fist. Yes! And uh, we're going to get Black Cat a little cat nap. But don't worry, she'll be back. Until we meet again, once again, tell us, is Spider-Man a friend or foe hey. or menace? Until then, God bless and happy gaming. Enjoy Monster Hunter tonight. Bye-bye. See ya.